um, this is going to be a hair review on this hair right here. Um, this is the Queen Weave Beauty um, from AliExpress. Now I know you guys have been asking like who is like where I got this hair from and I actually got it from my cousin. My cousin got it for me when we went back to Nigeria and um, yeah she never really told me who the vendor was and then I kept on asking her for like the past like four four months since I had this hair and she was like okay whatever I'll tell you and she actually got it from AliExpress and you guys know that I was never gonna go back to AliExpress after after my last install with um, another hair and I hated that hair so I love this hair and I'm gonna tell you why so I'm gonna start with the pros um, yeah, I have everything like written down here, so if I keep on looking down, you know why. So the pros, um, this hair does not shed at all, like hardly at all. Like I run my fingers through it, I get nothing, like all the time. I play with it all the time. Like if you see me in my videos, I'm always going like, like that all the time, and I get like no shedding. Um, and I didn't seal the wefts. Um, I only cut the wefts like when I start getting up like to the top of my head. That's when I started to cut the wefts, but um, I don't get any shedding. Okay, so the next thing is um, this hair does not tangle. I love that it does not tangle. Like yeah, sure you'll get a few snags and stuff like that, but like that's mostly near the ends. And I never used to get like snags until I um, colored the hair. Because I bleached it, then I colored it, and that's when it started to get like snags near the ends of the hair. But usually, when I when when I didn't dye the hair, that I didn't get like any tangles, and it was like it was awesome. I love this hair so much. Okay, um, this hair, um, yeah. So as I said before, I colored this hair, and seriously, like usually when people like color their hair, like the ends of the hair gets all like gross and disgusting but like my own it still looks really good and I dyed it I mean I bleached it then dyed it last week um and it still looks really really good this hair curls really really well and it straightens really really well as well I have um a curling video excuse me I have a curling video of <coughs> how I curl my hair using like um, a flat iron. I have that up on you know my channel. I actually use this when I straighten my hair. I use um, tension brush and I love this. I love using this on my hair when I when I flat iron it because it gives it a nice sleek look and if I don't want to use that I'm too lazy then I just use the comb chase method and that works really well as well. So I love using I love using this. Um, and the last thing for pros is that this hair lasts a very long time. Like I've had this hair for four months, it's about to hit five months. Um, and like that's like the longest I've ever like had my hair. Like before I had a middle part and then I kept that in from like January to like March. Then I took it out and then I wore it this way, I wore it in um, a side part. And now I'm like, I'm almost on my second month wearing it. I'm about to take it out when I get back home. But, like, it lasts a long time. Like, I was like, I was like, oh my god, am I really going to reuse this hair again? And when I go back to school after spring break? And yes, I did. And I was like, I was like, I'm getting kind of tired of it, so I decided to color it and stuff. So, yeah. So that's all for pros. Now for cons, there's hardly any cons. Only, like, two things. Um, for cons. This hair, you need to use heat protectant on this hair or you're going to get a lot of breakage. Like I get I get quite a bit of breakage with this hair because um, like when I first had it, I was always used to like, you know, just straining the hair without like heat protectant, just like, just, you know, and don't do that. <laughs> well, obviously, like don't do that. But this hair has a lot of breakage when I straighten it. Um, so make sure you use heat protectant and heat protectant I used is this Garnier Fructis style sleek and shine flat iron um, perfector straightening mist with argan oil oh my god 
that's, that's like a long ass name though like that's a long title like I mean like look at that it's a long title okay continuing but I love this I'm, I'm gonna go through all the products I used but I'm just quickly telling you that this is what I used and the last thing is um, I got straight hair like this is like Brazilian straight hair but when I wet it like it it doesn't wave up like oh my god like wavy it's like it just waves up a little it's like a slight little baby wave and then like it's really weird because it's supposed to be straight here so I thought that when I wet it it would just be straight but like it kind of waves up but then like when it starts to dry it's like uh, when it starts to dry that's when um, it starts to turn straight so I guess it doesn't it's not too bad but like I don't want it to be all wavy you know like when I wet it because that's why I decided to get um you know straight hair because I'm not really a fan of wavy hair anymore because I got tired of it I kind of don't like it I like straight hair so that's like a, a con about the hair but besides that those are the only two cons and obviously the pros outweigh the cons for this hair so that's why I love it so much um so let me go on to talking about the products that I use. And okay. Eee! Okay. So I use these two. I use the Suave Professionals um, Almond and Shea Butter Shampoo and Conditioner. I love these products. Um, it's a moisturizing shampoo. And I usually use this on my own hair. And I love it because it makes your hair feel so silky. It's so like buttery and so delicious and like ugh, I love it like I love using the conditioner and the shampoo like they just they just bring this hair back to life like if you think like this looks okay like you're gonna love it like when you use this cuz this hair seriously loves this um, but since my hair is colored I'm gonna have to um, go and get like a color a color treated type of shampoo and conditioner because I don't want like the dye to leave because it's already starting to leave a little um like near the end mostly like it's, it's starting to like leave and I'm like don't leave so pretty so yeah um I also use this on my hair as well um the Pantene um smooth and sleek with argan oil from Morocco is a two-in-one shampoo and conditioner like I would use these like on a, like a Sunday or something and then like maybe on a Wednesday I would like use this um to like kind of freshen up the hair <laughs> I never blow dry my hair I only let it air dry and when I let it air dry I usually do the French braids with my hair or I leave it or I leave it to um completely dry but I usually do the French braids um now because I kind of like it with like, I kind of like it when it's like French braided stuff. It looks cute. So I use this midweek and I use the Swap Professionals like maybe on a Sunday, like every week and stuff. I use um, the Garnier Fructi Sleek and Shine Anti-Frizz Serum. I love this. I love using this on my um, weave. Like it looks really nice when I use it. Like it just makes it really nice and sleek. And then last but not least is the Flat Iron. Flat Iron Mist by um, Garnier Fructis, and I love this. Um, it smells super good, and I feel like my hair straightens so much better when I use this and not any other straightening mist. And I like this thing because like it has um, argan oil in it, and I think that's why it makes my hair straighten really well. So you guys should get this. And then yeah, the tension brush. I like the tension brush. It's, it's pretty cool. I already explained about it. But, okay, so, um, that's all about, like, the hair. I'm gonna quickly talk about, like, the, like, how I dyed my hair. Um, I used a box dye. I used, um, splat. I'll make sure I leave it down below. Um, because my roommate always used splat on her own hair, so it's just like, I was like, oh my god, I love how it looks, because she always has, like, pink hair. And I was like, I was like, I want to try something different. So... She was like, you should try purple. So I was like, okay, I'll try purple. But I got more like a violet type of purple. Like, it looks a little bit purple, but like blue. Like, when I first dyed it, when I like first dyed it, 
it was like purple like when I'm like in a room or something but if I'm like outside it looks like like dark like dark uh, blue and it looks so cool like I was like oh my god this looks awesome but when I was trying to like dye it like some pieces were being like stubborn and didn't want to like dye like in the middle like right here as you can see like right there it didn't want to like dye but I think it looks pretty cool because like it it would go from like you know the 1B color to like this bleach color to like um to the dye color so I thought it looked pretty cool and I just like it see you can see it a little it looks really cool um so that's pretty much all I have to show you guys about the hair um if you have any questions make sure you leave them down below I'll make sure I get back to you guys so thank you guys for always supporting me and I love you guys so much um just I love you guys I love you guys like a lot so have an awesome day and I'll see you guys in the next video. Oh, no, no, no.